Uh, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Basil Paisy, and we have um, uh, just developed a new modular building system, which we are currently busy building in our factory here in Elsie's River, Cape Town, South Africa. And um, this is uh, a prototype, and uh, which is built to plans and accurately to all the uh, specifications which have been patented. What is the building center in Cape Town, South Africa? Uh, builders, uh, builders hub, with builders were in the backdrop. Oh, what am I looking there? Is the tools required for the construction erection of a remote tuck building system, which is, consists of what a uh, drill, right, is that the drill, a plain drill, you know, with a uh, posy bit, a mallet. A hammer and your screws and that's all you need okay there's all the components of our remote tech rapid and easy building system that's about to be put up we'll post you with the next stage of the construction of the rapid and easy remote tech building system uh, a revolutionary system to put up houses in a matter of days uh, all the components erect a structure uh, called the Remotec Rapid and Easy Building System which uh, is a frame, invention of a frame that can be used for straightforward timber frame but has this feature of uh, being able to, to be to have a concrete reinforced uh, backbone if you want poured into its very core uh, that reinforces the whole building and makes it a multi-story uh, type uh, system uh, and that can withstand obviously hurricanes. This is now the EcoBeam uh, base, standard frame uh, timber uh, frame um, base uh, on which we will erect our uh, structure okay well what we're doing now we're gonna start putting the panels up this is the corner panel it's a corner end post a specific profile one of the plus minus 50 components of the system uh, and what we're gonna do now is uh, erect the first panel all right the first panel is going up so we're going to attach the corner post together with one of the full panels which is also open just to document and show what is inside of the panel and how it's constructed. Once the screw uh, goes in, uh, it pulls the other board together and you've got an absolutely flush, flush connection. Alright, so we're busy fastening. As, you, as you've seen, the boards are totally flush. Um, the use of a clamp does help to get the walls together. So one, one can clamp the top and it brings them to a perfect, perfect seam. Well, there's the two panels and one uh, T-connect connect, uh, column, which is being now being fastened. Uh, and frankly, it's going very, very fast. It's very accurate. Anyways, it's 42 minutes past seven. 42 minutes have lapsed, lapsed and we're busy putting our window channel. Uh, and the progression is good. It's uh, 7.48. And we're busy putting in the uh, the other end column, this column is actually a four-way column. It enables you to make uh, walls the four ways, four ways around. And David's starting to get the hand of it. He's fitted it perfectly well. There it is, it's a perfect joint. Guys, you can start putting the screws in and we'll have finished this within a couple of minutes. This end post, the four-way end post will be in. Right, it's 8 o'clock, it's exactly one hour that we've started our structure and uh, we finished this little stone wall. We're going to put next the uh, 
door panel and the column will do the roof and the floor and there's a house or basically a, a portion of a house which can be anyway uh, you know uh, of any basically standing uh, this is not a, a, a particular sort of cost category structure it's a perfect structure uh, therefore usable for basically any uh, situation with uh, obviously adjustments and specifications that can change to accommodate building, building material f you know for the uh, for the job we're progressing we're putting the window okay but now we're going to fit the door into the modular panel that takes the door and that's an interesting part of it there we are it's made like this it's already got like a little lip now you can just slide it now before you do this you must take out the triangle Let's push it in guys. The door panel is being fitted in into its cavity. There. It's All right, our structure is now coming near to completion. Our column is in. And there's one particular aspect of installing the, the ceiling, which is our... Uh, you know our system part of our system uh, we fix those brackets and we've got these flush panel ceilings which are going to be then lifted up those uh, brackets will be removed afterwards but they are they will anchor the ceiling while we can lift it on the other side bring it to level and screw it all around so we will now process to installing the ceiling there our ceiling is going up our ceiling is going up, 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 okay, keep on going up, there's our ceiling going up. Anyways, there's the semi-finished product, it's not completed yet, we still got to put a roof on it, but uh, basically, you know, a couple of hours later, we're virtually finished. Uh, and we'll see you tomorrow morning when we put a roof and complete this. The next day, and there's a little rapid and easy modular building system, almost fully completed. Couple of planks on the floor, and couple of cornices, and the job's done. Okay, so our structure is like almost complete with all its um, cladding options. So this is a timber siding, sort of log siding uh, just to demonstrate that we can dress the system and uh, make it look cute the floor is finished Oregon pine floor and David's busy putting some uh, beadings to fill up the gaps and um, that's it